In a recent press release, the NGOs Human Rights Watch and Amnesty International have called for the immediate release of those detained arbitrarily in Niger by the military regime resulting from the July coup. They also condemn repressions against journalists and opponents of the government. Human Rights Watch Sahel researcher Ilaria Legosi quoted in the statement that the military regime must ensure respect for human rights and guarantee freedom of the press. The two NGOs recall that since the coup d'etat which overthrew him, President Mohamed Bazoum, has been detained in his presidential residence with his wife and son. They add that several ministers of the fallen regime have been incarcerated in different prisons across the country. They also claim that authorities have threatened, harassed, intimidated and arbitrarily arrested journalists, young people, and suspected political opponents, as well as people expressing critical opinions. Journalists in Niger experience increased pressures in carrying out their activities, they emphasize, adding that local and international journalists have been threatened, verbally harassed online, and physically attacked. According to Usman Diallo, Sahel researcher at Amnesty International's West and Central Africa office, freedom of expression, decent and press freedom, are essential to the enjoyment of other rights and to government accountability.